Hi guys, let's go ahead and get started with our phonics warm up for today. Remember, you're gonna see a card with the, with the letter and you're gonna tell me what sound it makes. I wanna hear it out loud so that it helps your brain remember what this says. Here we go. Oh, U, consonant E says U. This is our new one for this week. PH is the F digraph. Good job. E. Z. T. Ch. Z. Go. A consonant E says A. Good job. Sk. Er. That's another one of those H brothers. Th. Sk. Th. Ch. Cl. I consonant E says I. Ha. K. Full. E consonant E says E S S N N O Sh B O consonant E says O Qua Y Ah G, P, S, M, M, E, K, F, V, P, K, S. Remember, this one's breathy and it sounds like the H comes first. Good job. All right, I want you to write your sound that you hear or the sound that the letter makes on the table. So you're going to write it big. All right, are we ready? Here we go. My first sound is bull. Bull. B L says bull. Very good. Qu. Qu. Q U says qu. There's, we know three ways to make three ways to make this sound. K. K. C says k. K says k. C K says k. Good job. E. E. E says e. Very good. Sh. Sh. S. H says sh. Good job. Y. Y. Y says y. Good job. We know three ways to make this sound. Think about it. F. F. All right. The first two should be easy. We know that. F says f. F F says f. This week we learned another one. Do you remember what it is? That digraph. P H says f. Very good. My next sound is h. Listen carefully. H. W H says h. Good job. A A. A consonant E says A. Very good. Th. Th. T 
H says th. Very good. Ah. Ah. O says ah. Very good. All right, here we go. Let's read some words. Let's use what we know about some phonics to read some words. Here we go. All right, we hear blow, ass, blast, right? We hear the A, it's gonna say ah, because it has a consonant sound after it. Here we go. Q, U, we know those go together. Qu, eh, k, quack. Y, uh, sh, yush. Very good. Wh, aid, wade. D, a, th, dath. Good job. N, off, nof. Good job. Sh, if, shif. Good job. All right, we're going to practice our vowel sounds. Remember, you're going to point to your vowel that it, the, vow, the vowel that you hear in the middle of our word. Here we go. My word is yip. Yip. Y. Ip. Yip. I. Very good. My word is pop. Pop. Ah. Oh, very good. Sod, sod, sod. Oh, good job. Dip, 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 dip. I, very good. My word is rat, rat, r at. Rat. A. Very good. My last word is bet. B. E. T. Bet. E. Very good. All right, let's review all that we've learned so far. I'm going to move myself out of the way. Here we go. We've learned about our vowels A, E, I O U. And they have two sounds that they can make. They can make their closed sound, which means they're just going to make their sound. So, a, e, i, a, a. And we know that they can make their open sound, or that's when they say their name. A, e, i, o, u. And right now we know that the way they're going to say their name is when magic E works with them. Okay? When we hear the k sound, we talked about multiple different things. We know that the k, ck, is normally heard at the end of a word, or it's always heard at the end of a word, and it comes after a short vowel sound, like l, a, k, or p, a, k. C can be used at the beginning of a word, or, and it is usually, comes before the letters a, o, and u. K is generally used at the beginning of the word before the letters E or I, okay? We talked about our blends, which are two letters that still make their own sounds, but we can push them closer with our blending bowl to help make them quicker. So, s, u, sol, right? We talked about the floss rule or Miss Fizzle with her two foxes, her two skunks, her two zebras, and her two lizards. These always are doubled after a short vowel sound. We hear the ch sound. Ch. We talked about ch. Ch is at the end of a word with a long vowel, like e or a. We talked about tch, which normally comes at the end of a word with after a short vowel or when a vowel says it's sound, okay? And then last week we talked about magic E, which makes those words or those vowels say their long sound or their name, all right? Now, we are going to um, end this video while you're, before you move to the next video, I want you to grab your phonics notebook or your whiteboard to get ready to move on.